What now, Ancestor? It seems Beerus the Destroyer has already claimed another planet. I've never seen him this frightened. Not even during Majin Buu's rampage. Is this latest awakening of Beerus truly so ominous? There are deities like us who exist to create and protect life in the universe. But the opposite is also true. Some deities exist only to end life. Beerus the Destroyer is such a being. Yes, I'm well aware of that, but as detestable as it is to us, there is a reason for his destructive ways. No, there is no reason at all. The inevitability of his existence does not give meaning to what he does. Beerus acts only on his own whims. He is nothing but bottled chaos, and we must make sure that no one shakes that bottle up. The last thing our universe needs is for a battle-loving warrior to challenge Lord Beerus to a fight and whip him into a destructive frenzy. You say that as if you have someone specific in mind. Oh, you mean Goku! Of course I do! That punch-happy fool would try to fight Beerus just for fun, which is why we can't let him know he exists! Well, that shouldn't be too hard, since Beerus's energy can only be sensed by other deities. And since Goku's back on Earth, he's practically on the other side of the universe from Beerus. So there's almost zero chance of them running into each other. I certainly hope you're right.